The women's suffrage movement was a decades-long fight to win the right to vote for women in the United States. On August 26, 1920, the 19th Amendment to the Constitution was ratified, enfranchising all American women and declaring for the first time that they, like men, deserve all the rights and responsibilities of citizenship. But that didn't give all women the right to vote. Ratification of the 19th Amendment in 1920 expanded voting rights substantially, but it did not address the racial tensions that prevented African Americans in southern states from voting regardless of sex. Many continued the fight for voting rights for all, which culminated in the passage of the Voting Rights Act of 1965. The Voting Rights Act was one of the crowning achievements of our democracy the result of Republican and Democratic efforts. During the 2020 Democratic National Convention, former First Lady Michelle Obama spoke about the importance of voting. And when the horrors of systemic racism shook our country and our consciences, millions of Americans of every age, every background rose up to march for each other, crying out for justice and progress. This is who we still are, compassionate, resilient, decent people whose fortunes are bound up with one another. And it is well past time for our leaders to once again reflect our truth. So it is up to us to add our voices and our votes to the course of history Reporting for New Jersey News Network, I'm Veronica Dudo.